Washington, the U.S. ambassador to the EU, testifying in an open hearing today. Gordon Sondland told lawmakers that there was a quid pro quo, and he personally worked to broker the deal. KCAU 9's Washington correspondent Alexander Lamone has the latest from Capitol Hill. U.S. Ambassador to the EU Gordon Sunland testified that he personally worked to get Ukraine to publicly announce investigations that President Trump wanted. Was there a quid pro quo? As I testified previously, with regard to the requested White House call and the White House meeting, the answer is yes. But Sunland said he didn't realize the company Burisma was tied to the Bidens. He also said he was not part of a shadow campaign to get Ukraine to cooperate with the president. Everyone was in the loop. Sunland said President Trump, Vice President Pence, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo, Energy Secretary Rick Perry, former National Security Advisor John Bolton, and White House Chief of Staff Mick Mulvaney all went along with the plan. Sundland told lawmakers he spoke to President Trump directly about the investigations. The chairman of the House Intelligence Committee, Adam Schiff, said Sundland's testimony is among the most significant. It goes right to the heart of the issue of bribery, uh, as well as other potential uh, high crimes or misdemeanors. Sundland also told lawmakers that after learning that military aid to Ukraine was on hold, he came to the conclusion that that aid was also dependent on those investigations. President Trump mounted his own defense, quoting one conversation in which Sunland asked him what he wanted from Ukraine. I say to the ambassador in response, I want nothing, I want nothing, I want no quid pro quo. In Washington, Alexandra Limon.